Well, let's talk about the kind of squabbling that's going on between the Congress and the TMC. Now, Mamta Banerjee continues to launch a tirade against the Congress after Mamta's bold proclamation that UPA is now non-existent. TMC has yet again, yet again hit out at the Grand Old Party in its mouthpiece, Jago Bangla. The title of the editorial says, Congress is in deep freezer. It says that in spite of being the largest opposition party, Congress has locked itself in deep freezer. In its veiled attack on Rahul Gandhi, TMC says that instead of organizing people's movement, Congress leaders are happily tweeting. Congress's internal squabble over leadership also has got mentioned in this article. The article also says that coalition of opposition forces is the need of the hour to defeat the BJP and Mamta is the most popular and acceptable opposition face. वो बीजेपी पार्टी को दिया हुआ हुक का पी रहे हैं तो क्या करें उनको कुछ नहीं दिखाई देते हैं ये सारे बयानबाजी इसलिए हो रहे हैं कि मोदी जी को खुश रखना चाहिए अब बताओ अंक गणित को अगर जरा सा भी उनका ज्ञान रहे और उनकी पार्टी की रही तो ये बताएं कि चार फीसद वोट लेकर वो मोदी जी को सत्ता से कैसे हटाइए ये अंक गणित बताइए इंद्रजीत कुंडू इज गेटिंग इंद्रजीत Mamta Banerjee and the TMC really no more making no secret of the fact that she obviously has prime ministerial ambitions and wants to project herself as the most credible leader uh, to counter the BJP essentially. But there's a huge question mark on how many in the opposition will rally around Mamta and would actually choose to keep Congress outside of this opposition, including the NCP. Well, Sneha, at this point in time, clearly Mamta Banerjee and the Trinamool Congress are trying to actively position themselves as uh, uh, Mamta Banerjee as a sole leader of this entire opposition pack. And uh, it's been going on for a long, long time. Mamta Banerjee, of course, was two days uh, back, met Sharad Pawar in Mumbai. Uh, and uh, at this point in time, the Trinamool is going whole hogs against the Congress because they believe that the Congress is not acting enough in their opposition against the Modi dispensation. And uh, in various states like Goa and in Tripura, the Trinamool Congress is working really hard to dislodge the Congress as a principal opposition party in those uh, in those spaces. So clearly, uh, Mamta Banerjee and the Trinamool Congress think tank clearly feels that at this point, uh, it is the Trinamool Congress which uh, has the trust and the faith of other opposition leaders and parties especially in the backdrop of the kind of success that they have got in the West Bengal Assembly elections. And they think that is the criteria. The electoral success in West Bengal is what uh, gives them the opportunity, the position, to position themselves as the sole leader of the opposition pack. And not Rahul Gandhi, who the Trinamool Congress in the editorial clearly claims is busy, you know, trying to douse and clarify the internal uh, squabbles within the Congress. And also the fact that in successive elections across various states, uh, the Congress has not been able to deliver the kind of results of the Rahul Gandhi's leadership. Absolutely. In fact, the daggers are clearly drawn between the Congress and the Trinamool Congress. And this war of words is on. Uh, let's now take a look at uh, what's been going on between Mamta Banerjee and the Congress party. Like I said, the daggers are clearly drawn. Uh, you know, no sugarcoating anything. Mamta Banerjee has been making some statements against the Congress and the Congress is extremely unhappy about what's going on. Now, what is really going on? Mamta Banerjee essentially has said that Congress is in deep freezer. That's one of the statements that Mamta Banerjee has made in the past. Congress says that spurned consultant pressurizing Mamta. That's where the pressure is coming from. Mamta says that Congress is riddled with internal squabbles. Congress and its counter has said Mamta under pressure of the BJP and the ED. That's where all these statements are coming from. Mamta and her attack has said that this boy referring to Rahul Gandhi has no future to which the Congress says Congress without the UPA is like body without soul since Mamta had suggested that UPA is non-existent. Mamta again says that Rahul stays abroad and does politics here while Congress says that Mamta is damaging the opposition unity by making such statements. Mamta says there is no UPA, it is dead. Congress says Mamta is waging an immature campaign.